All right, Gavin's going to close up the tent. Go ahead, Gavin. Cooking a little breakfast over the open fire this morning. Gavin's already enjoying his over there. Morning, Gavin. Nice hair. Nice hair, dude. Here's our tent set up on the Jeep WJ Grand Cherokee. Super easy to set up. Sets up in minutes. The longest is to put the little poles in to hold the rain fly out. Right now I got uh, a couple camp boxes I've had for probably 20, 22 years. I've had these boxes. They're uh, bolted down on the floor. With all my camping gear. up guys good morning thought I'd do a little walk around to the Jeep this morning we found this awesome little campsite got it all set up slept a little rough but haven't slept in a tent in a while but the Jeep worked great we probably covered about maybe 30 40 miles of trip well maybe I don't know 30 miles of trails dirt roads yesterday kind of switching back coming around finally found this spot there's a few things that I already realized I need to do in the tent to uh, make it a little more functional needs a power port needs some straps for the uh, cover hanging down there to be able to roll that up but deployed in about maybe five minutes you know putting all the little which Madu's on there and uh, to hold up the rain fly. It was a really nice cool night here in Florida. It's got the sun coming through there. But overall for the first trip I think I got less than two grand in this whole rig here between the Jeep, the tent, and uh, the repairs. I had to do the Jeep so I'll give a tally later on in the video of what I've got into it so far but you know this kind of goes to show you guys that you can get out for relatively small amount of money and get out there and do it you don't have to have a fifty thousand dollar rig as a matter of fact the trails we were going down last night were so tight 
I, we were laughing about not worrying about the paint. I'll zoom in here on this. I don't know if you can see all these scratches. This is from one, you know, evening of wheeling. I don't know if you can see all these scratches. Yeah, you can see them. There's so much brush here in Florida on these trails. You know, if this was a $50,000 rig with a brand new paint job, you would be really hesitant to go places that we went last night. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed part one of the Jeep Grand Cherokee project. I uh, picked this baby up for 500 bucks. I'm gonna go through the list of everything I've spent so far to get it back on the road and running and driving. Um, I did just add the tent, um, which is pretty cool. Um, we have a long list of things we're gonna be doing um, from lifts, rock sliders, bumpers, um, roof rack, cutting the fenders, um, dual batteries, probably solar panel, uh, rear organizer, basically turn it into an overlanding vehicle. I've been overlanding since I was like 18, um, so a good 20, 25 years I've had different vehicles. Um, I'll throw some pictures up of one of my first ones I built when I was 18, an old uh, Ford Explorer. Um, so stay tuned for the next one. We're going to try to put out a video at least once a month with the uh, upgrades that we're doing to the Jeep and uh, also check out other projects that we have going here in the shop. If you uh, need to pick up some merch, this is from my Lincoln Continental friends, but uh, Deviant hats, t-shirts, there's a link down below where you can click on and pick up some uh, cool, cool merchandise. Peace out, guys.